Hey guys, how's it going? Kyle Dibbon here, Bullion RV, Duluth, Minnesota. And today I get a chance to walk you through a 26 DBH from Forest River. It's a Gray Wolf Limited Edition. It just came in. It's a 2022. We're going to get you around the outside. We'll get you inside of the rig and we'll see what you think. We're going to start you right up front here today with the pass-through storage. Well, not pass-through, but the front storage here you get into from the bed as well. As you see that spot there, you got a nice light in here for you. Um, right up front, these come with a battery and a battery box. It's got a juice pack on board, so a 50 watt solar panel on the roof. Two 20 pound uh, propane tanks that we're gonna fill and a power tongue jack right up front here as well. Nice cool thing, as you can see, the power cord. It's got a nice spot to live so it's not dragging in the dirt. Little things like that matter. You don't think so till you have one, then you'll never go without one. On the back side, you got one big slide. So we'll back up, give you a pan of that. Notice all the windows. You got the one up front for the bedroom, and the two big windows here in the living space. One over the couch, and one over the dinette. On the back of this unit is where you're going to find your water connection. So you get your fresh water, your city water. You're going to have your power cord. You have an outdoor shower with hot and cold. A nice convenient light in case you uh, are dumping tanks late at night or hooking up to get to the campsite a little late. You got to hook up. You got your sewer hose right down here, your connections. And then a really another nice um, outdoor storage area that is under the bunks right in the back here. On the back side of the camper, you're gonna notice a nice rack, coolers, generator, kids' bikes, whatever you got going on. You got a spot to hook up a spare tire on here as well. Right up top, you're gonna have a backup camera that comes on here. And now on the camp side, you can see I got the awning out, really nice big awning underlit by blue LED lights. You do have an entry door right into the bathroom for those kids right in, right out. You're not getting all that dirt through the camper. Great feature there. Leash latch for your buddy, your husbands, anybody wandering off, you can hook them down. 1500 pound capacity on that right there as well. Um, so if you head away from the unit, you want to hook up some kid bikes, lock them to that, lock your generator to that, hook up Philo to that, you got that capability right outside as well. Alright, this is the awning. Spans over your outdoor kitchen, you got your outdoor speakers, you got a spot out here for a TV, you got your power hookups, your cable. You can see the blue LED lights here in Minnesota, those blue LED lights are going to be nice, help keep the bugs away at night. You know, the bright white lights attracted them, so that's really convenient there. In the outdoor kitchen, you got two burner cooktop here, nice outdoor fridge, an ice maker, can never have too much ice. You got hot and cold water out here on this side as well. And then right down below, you can see you have a quick connect for your grill. So you can hook up the two burner, or if you want to bring a portable grill, you can hook up to that as well. Nice aluminum rims. We'll kind of sneak you in, see if you can see. You can see a green, nice tire pressure monitor gauge. You stop to get gas, check those out. Green means go. If it's showing red, you're gonna need air. Nice, quick, like, I mean, you just kind of check that. You know, so you don't have to carry around your air pressure gauge. Just a nice, quick kind of check on that thing. Check on your air, convenient. Solid step stairs, coming all the way to the ground. So for this unit being a bunkhouse, you're gonna have a lot of people with you. So going in and out of this front steps, it's gonna help from keeping the camper from shaking all over the place. Really nice. All right, we'll bring you in. Dry weight on this camper, just shy of 5,900 pounds. So any half ton truck, you gonna be able to pull this. Like I said, it really fits the whole family. So kind of back you up, show you the living space. You got a really nice kitchen with the corner sink. You got power in the back here. You got power tucked right up top. You got push puck lights for you. Really nice convenient um, shower, not shower, uh, kitchen sink, pull down faucet for you. Um, stainless steel sink in there as well. So if you're cooking mac and cheese for the kids, any hot pans, throw them in the sink, you're not gonna melt those plastic sinks. Really nice feature there. Couch folds out into a like a futon style that'll fold down to a bed you got a really nice u-shaped dinette that could sleep probably two adults pretty comfortably on there big double over double bunk in the back 
Um, nice thing I like about this is you got windows on both of them. You also have lights and USB and power outlets on both of them as well. Really nice for the kids. You're just going to see power everywhere. Another power port here. You got a USB that's tucked in right there. I don't know if you can see that little green light USB right there. Like I said, here's those big windows from the inside. What I really like about this unit is these storage drawers under the U-shaped dinette. You got one under each side. Um, they just pull out all the way. So you don't gotta be digging all the way to the back of that. You just put it in the door, tuck it in, so you can get at it. Really nice and convenient. You got this really big pantry in here as well. A lot of room to store a lot of food. Like I said, this unit can sleep about nine people, so you're gonna need a lot of food. And with a lot of food, you're gonna need a big fridge. Really nice new feature here is the 12 volt fridges. You get a 10.3 cubic foot fridge instead of the eight cubic two-way with that power on the top with the solar panels gonna help you run this. They're a lot more efficient, one less hole in the camper. Um, really nice feature here. Kind of back you up and show you the pan from here. What else I like about this is you got a fireplace down here. That is an electric fireplace, putting about, about 5,000 BTU worth of heat. So on those cooler mornings here in Minnesota, you can fire that up, take that chill off the air nice and quick. At night, you got some ambiance, a little nightlight, great feature there. Here's gonna be your entertainment spot for a TV. You got your AM, FM, Bluetooth, auxiliary uh, radio controls right there. Some storage, a little eight inch subwoofer for that extra party sound. And then, You get the blue lights up there too. Nice cool light. I like the blue lights in it. Moving into the bedroom. Queen size bed. You got the wardrobe on both sides. You got the above head wardrobe as well. The storage with doors, which is really nice. Sometimes it's just a shelf. So this way you can actually stack stuff in there and it's not gonna be falling out, going down the road or you're not gonna have to move it put it in the back and forth. Um, really nice doors to keep that in there. Also really convenient, you got these little tabletops, nightstands on each side, you got power, so if you have a CPAP machine or anything, you do have power and a little spot to put them, and that's gonna be on both sides as well. And then you do have windows on each side for some nice cross ventilation. So just a great unit here at Bullion RV. Again, my name is Kyle Dittman. Happy to help you any way I can. I'll give you one more pan here. Best way to reach me is give me a call or shoot me a text at 218-740-4964. Happy to help any way I can. Call me day or night. I'm here to help. Camping season just around the corner. Give us a call, come check, us, come check some stuff out. We'll see you soon.